encounter at Nariman House is over, but the images of the assault at this Jewish residential complex still haunt the nation. We were reporting from right across this building the night the rabbi and his wife were taken hostage. Soldiers fired smoke grenades and gunshots continued. But by Thursday morning, there was finally some good news. Moshe and his nanny had managed to escape. I was in the kitchen. I came running to, you know, just stop them. And I see that one man is shooting at me. He shot at me. And it was like something, I don't know. Like I was, but still in that time also I could close the door. It was up till next morning when the baby called me. Moshe, when I went, he was next to Ima standing and crying my name. That's, that's what I remember. What were you thinking? What, what goes through your mind? My first thought was for the baby. But yes, it was always for the baby. But then when I saw my rabbi and his wife, I thought today even I'm thinking that I should have sent the baby and you know, done something for the rabbi and his wife. But you said, you said Moshe, how was he when you saw him, when you, when you picked him up? When I picked him up, he was quiet. That's why I could bring him out. I don't know, if somebody else was there, maybe he would have made a racket. Just because it was me and he's been from the baby in my arms. So he, he, nothing. Were you scared as you ran out of the house or was it just about Moshe? Scared? No, I was like, just the baby should be, you know, just take the baby and run. Frankly speaking, even I don't know what I was thinking. I just picked up the baby and I ran. And the other worker also was with me, Jackie. We ran, we just ran. Like mad, we just ran. When I hear gunshots, it's like not one, two. It's like hundreds of gunshots. 10, 20 granites bombed in the cabal. So, what, even I'm a mother of two children. So I just pick the baby and I run. I don't think of fear. Does anybody think of dying at that moment when my small precious babies? No. And how are you coping now? Me? Baby is there, Sandra is there. That's it. I knew the rabbi well. He would often come to this very site, discuss construction with me and the engineers. He had his own peculiar way of touching our hearts. I was there with him till the end when his body was brought down along with the fire brigade personnel. This is a tribute to his family and Moshe. <laughs> It's very hard fighting terror, so what you can do is just carry on, continue your life, don't stop anything. If you let terror win, then it succeeded. miraculous escape of their two-year-old son Moshe has triggered the Sandeep Unikrishnan of NSG has lost his life.